Hi, my name's Leona Edwards, Manager of Sport and Recreation at Wodonga Council. I'm here at the fantastic new facility, the AFL and Cricket and Netball Pavilion at the Barranduda Fields Sporting Complex. The facility will be able to host um, a range of events whether they are school activities, community activities, training programs. The site will actually give us what we call as a neutral location, which will enable us to host both cricket games, netball games, football matches from competing uh, competitions and competing states and regions. What that will mean is no one side has a, a home ground advantage, but they can use this site as a neutral location. It has adequate parking, fantastic amenities, great change rooms that I think will be really, really well received by community and by the particular user groups who we're going to bring out here. As I said, Council's very excited to have this facility um, available as of next year for the use of, of community and groups. So the facilities that we have here are really quite different to what the offering is in Wodonga, where we have both AFL and netball facilities co-located in the one location. The facilities are able to be used as an open plan, but the change rooms can also be uh, divided and separated into two separate teams. Even our canteen here that we're, fa we're, we're standing in front of is dual facing. It has the ability to service both patrons for the netball and patrons for the football. Our change rooms are AFL sized so they are very large and, and gives us that flexibility to host a range of different sports. They have separate amenities. There's also such a large plan that you could put in trainers and other user groups within that space while they're being used in the team environment. There's separate umpire amenities. Now we have two of those which so you could break up into male and female and we also have separate public toilets including disabled toilets located at the back of the precinct which again gives us everything in the one space. Um, predominantly this has happened in multiple multiple locations or multiple buildings on a site. To have that all in the one central location really gives the user and the patrons that, that flexibility and, and, and opportunities to do a range of things at the site. So the Barranduda Fields AFL netball and football facility is going to provide council and the community with a flexibility to be able to provide facilities when home venues are unavailable. Now there's a range of times when that can happen. Our parks and garden staff do a wonderful job of our facilities. They oversow and they renovate our ovals on twice a year, several occasions. Now when we do do this, teams are quite often put on alternate training venues. Now they'll be able to be relocated out to this site which is a premium site, a site that is equivalent to, if not better, than what they are playing on at the moment. The other flexibility we'll be able to do is, is provide a home and a space for some of those programs which just can't get going in Wodonga or Barranduda because they don't have a facility or a location where they can be held. AFL North Eastern Border, Cricket Aubrey Wodonga will be able to utilise this site without having to fit into the existing schedules on other fields inside Wodonga. So that flexibility that it's going to give our users our high level regional associations a really good opportunity to start programs that we've never been able to hold in Wodonga previously. So this is one of the most exciting things to happen in Wodonga in many years. I think it's the first facility, new facility that we've built in in over 10 years and I just can't wait come 2024 when we can get the users and the communities out here to use this wonderful facility, these beautiful netball courts, this AFL sized ground, turf wickets and just get people out here to use it. Host some fantastic events and activities and, and the, the community to see this wonderful location.